Hey guys, how you guys doing? Welcome to this video. We're back again here in this video right here. So we're back again and also going to say welcome back to this YouTube video right here. I've never done it on YouTube. I've been on YouTube for uh, quite some time actually because uh, I've never been posted to say obviously because of a day life. And also went to my dad's. Never been went to my dad's since last week. Or possibly um, not last week. Um, that was last month in June actually. So that's why I feel safe, obviously, because that's what it is. But, so yeah, I've never done this YouTube video for quite some time. The time is 11pm on Tuesday. It's 11pm. 11pm in the evening. 11 o'clock at night. So, this is what it feels like. But, and also, I've never done this, like, a uh, sad video over celebrities passing right here. And this is the one that happened um, on the fourth month this year. Uh, if you are if you are a fan of um, our channel four comedy show Friday Night Dinner, I'm going to tell you a sad news to make. Um, one of the best, one of the best ones I ever saw. One of the best ones I, well, I can't really say right now because it's getting a little bit, still a little getting a little emotional. I saw that that one would feel shocking, to the least. Um, the English actor, or the best popular English actor, Paul Ritter has already passed away, age 54 on the 5th of April this year, from, from brain tumor, he's suffering from brain tumor, and unfortunately he has sadly passed away due to his brain tumor, at his home at Hathras Kent, or Hathras Kent, and surrounded by his family by his side, or his wife by his side, and two sons, Frank and Noah, and a wife, her wife, his wife, Polly Rancliffe. It was so sad, like, um, and as soon as that, everyone feels shocking and sad to see Paul Ritter passing. And and also, I was so shocked to see the sad news. And also, I shared it on Facebook that over Paul Ritter's passing. And I really like Paul Ritter. Possibly love Paul Ritter. Um, he's a clever man, and he's a clever main character who played as um, Martin Goodman from Finite Dinner. Um, the news just just shocked right here. Just saw the news. If you, if you saw the news on the fifth of April, and if you saw the shocking breaking news over the Paul Ritter, who sadly died, uh, due from his suffering brain tumor, and this is what I felt what just really happens. So yeah, he died of a brain tumor. Age fifty four. His home surrounded his family. Um, long time friend Stephen Mangan tweeted, tried to find a way to talk about Paul Ritter and struggling. My friends since we were a student together, so much talent. Shine it, Sean, and it shone from him even as a teenager. I was so lucky to know him and lucky to, to work with him many times over the years. Wonderful man. That is Stephen Mangan. And Tamsin Gregg, if you don't know, if you do know Tamsin Gregg, if you are right here, as uh, she was uh, intimately grateful, pretty nice, pretty grateful, right here. He's a good sense of humor. Simon Bird from the Inbetweeters says he's always inspired to be like him. Whilst Tom Wilsonfall call him an ultimate professional, definitely ultimate professional. And this is like this is um um probably the fifth month before June. The uh, Channel Four hired uh, a documentary of Friday Night Dinner, ten years and loving it of bit, and a lovely bit of school. And this is like a documentary released, the documentary of Friday Night Dinner, ten years since they first hired on Channel Four back in 2011. And we 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 get to share some good memories out there. We get some share some good memories. Yeah, I've watched. Bit of Friday Night Dinner on Channel Four. Possibly I watched it on YouTube channel. At least they're showing the no at least they have notifications to see what the clips from the episode of Friday Night Dinner. It was very funny and also really pretty funny as well. Of the Friday Night Dinner, pretty much enjoyed the film, the show, of or focusing on the regular dinner experience of the middle class British Jewish Goodman family every Friday night. It was very amazing as well. Um, so yeah, following the conclusion of the sixth series and Paul Ritter's death, it announced that the show will not return. And yeah, it was so sad to see the, the shows what has been going on all summer right now. 
well, the best actor. He was the best man ever seen uh, for, happen before that always shines light over over a good, talented British actor. A lovely man, a lovely old man, and it always still makes you laugh to death. And this is what it feels the the the, 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 the I can't speak um, the lovely joy of happiness the spread the show the spread of a true fantastic love. Maybe you'll laugh. Maybe everyone laugh. Make you laugh. Make you cry. Everything as well. And also they did a video of the movie. And TV shows such as um, the Harry Potter and the Half Blood Prince, um, and um, television film Tommy Cooper, not like that, like this, and uh, Nowhere Boy back in 2009, and the uh, 2008 of the 2008 James Bond film Quantum of Solace, and the 2007 Son of Rambo, and other movies, and many more. Including ITV drama Fira as well. So that was quite sad. Let's see that that's unfortunately the passing of the main character, um, Martin Goodman. It is a good one as well. And also, we love phone at dinner. Best catchphrase Shalom. That's why I say hi in the Jewish way. And that's what, what it, what it gets some memory, shares some memories of it. I never done a watch. Never watched a documentary before. I have watched like um, Tamsin Grigg introduce and closing of the program um, to Paul Ritter. Sally passed. Sally passing. Everyone's had a tribute on Twitter, um, including Stephen Mangan, Steve Simon Bird, and the other British actor and the British celebs as well, um, as well. Uh, Eddie Mars, Eddie Marsden as well. Um, as well, um, they're all some tributes as well. Simon Bird already, Tamsin Grigg, Mark Heap, um, and the other one, Will Miller as well, and the other one as well. All the other ones as well are paying tribute to um, Paul Ritter. He was a clever man. He is the best. What are they the best ones that we saw? He's a best. He's a good one. He's in Kent, actor from Kent, in Kent. Um, do you want to share some memories of Paul Ritter, the home of Friday night dinner? It was a good show, actually. Um, it feels like I was. I feel so shocked to see the see the news just coming at all. To saw the news just really coming, just after the start of April. It was so shocking, and. Definitely want to share some memories to him. Fraser and Glass will get some dinner, get some Friday night dinner on the fr get some dinner on a Friday to share some memories of Paul Ritter, who sadly passed away of a in April. And yeah, he's a clever, talented person. Really enjoy it. So, so yeah, rest in peace already. I never done that. Um, there's uh, never done that as well. I'm all really late to the party. I'm always late to the party of it because I was really what was going on. But just want to share some memories. A late, um, a late memories. Share some late memories. Late because that's really celebrate celebrate as well. Like a documentary of it, um, of Friday night dinner. Ten years of Friday night dinner, and unfortunately, they will not return. Announce unfortunately the film of the. And unfortunately, that the show from Friday Night Dinner is dead now. Um, God. So, rest in peace, um, Paul Ritter. He's a clever one. And he's a clever, clever, talented guy I ever saw. So, alongside with the actor, um, Stephen Manger. Uh, it was the best one as well. Best together since as a teenager. And unfortunately... Unfortunately, I'm not going to see Paul Ritter again. So, yeah, hope you guys enjoy it, guys. Take care. Have a good day. R.I.P. Paul Ritter. Best, best English actor in Kent. Take care, guys. And have a nice Wednesday tomorrow. Take care. Goodbye.